Hi guys! So today I'm going to show you how I made my sunflower crop top or you can use this as a cover up as well. So uh, this is a very quick and easy pattern so perfect for the beginners. So these are the sunflower that we will be using. And by the way, I have a separate, a separate videos on how to make the sunflower. So I, I will put the link in the description box below. So we will be using the scrap yarn to connect our sunflower. So this is what we are going to do. We will arrange the sunflower. Uh, so the number of the sunflower, uh, it depends on the body size. So I am a small size, so I don't uh, need a lot of uh, sunflower. So now we will uh, just sew them to each other to connect them. And uh, make sure that you put it upside down so that all the tails of the yarn will be the inside. There's a lot of ways on how to connect the sunflower. Uh, when you are making a grand square, there's also that. You can also make that from this. But for me, this is the easiest way and the quicker way, so um, I choose this one. So make sure that you did not pull the yarn too tightly so that your project will not shrink. But also make sure that uh, each of the petals you connect it to each other. So uh, here, if you notice, I'm only using one strand of the yarn to sew them because if I use two strands, it will be bulky and uh, the, the finished product is not too clean. So this one, it looks thin and uh, very light. So we're almost done uh, connecting or sewing the one part of our crop top. So we will be doing two of this. So the back part and the front part of our uh, crop top. So there you go. So we're done for the one side of our crop top. So uh, if you make it upside down, this will be the outside. So then I will make the other... Uh, side of our uh, crop top and then I'll be back to show you how I connect the both uh, side of our project. So there you go. So I'm done the connecting the uh, other side of our crop top. So now we will just arrange it and uh, connect the sides. So now I am connecting the both side of our project. So again, don't pull the yarn too tight so that your uh, project will not shrink. So this is the part of the arm, armpit. And um, we will do it also on the other side. We will also connect that. So this is also what will you do in this other side of the crop top. So um, we're almost done. And then uh, I will make that off cam. And then I'll be back to show you how I make the strap of our uh, crop top. So there you go, we're done connecting the both side of our crop top. And I'm also added the straps, the three straps. So I uh, keep one to show you how I made it. So I use this uh, green yarn to represent the leaves. So we will chain one and then insert our hook in the petal space. And then along the way, we will hide the tail of the yarn so uh, our project looks clean. So yeah, we will just make a chain of, uh, I think, 50 or 70. It's up to you how long your uh, uh, chain you wanted or the strap of your uh, project. So for me, I made a 70 chain. You can choose any color of the strap of your crop top. It's up to you what color you want. But for me, I want the green. So as I said, I want it looks like a, a leaves of our uh, sunflower. So I choose the green one. So then after that uh, long enough uh, chain, um, we will just make a single crochet. Tell the where you start your chain. So I think this is long enough. Um, so now from the, uh, in the second uh, stitch from your hook, we will just make a single crochet. 
till we reach in the very beginning of our chain. By the way, the size of the hook that I am using is 3.25. I think I forgot to mention that. And then my yarn is cotton yarn. But you can use any size of the hook that you wanted. Almost done. So we reach here in the very start of our chain. So uh, we will just do a single crochet where we put our chain. And then uh, we will uh, make a slip stitch in the next stitch of the uh, sunflower and then chain one and then flip your work and uh, and a slip stitch we are just making sure that our project is uh, uh, good enough and uh, the tail of the yarn will not get lost so there you go we're almost done the only thing that uh, takes a bit time on, of making this is when I am making the sunflower I, it takes longer than connecting this to each other. Connecting it's very easy and putting the strap. So there you go, we're almost done. And we're done, ta -da. So this is what it looks without the beads. Because I added beads here, so it's up to you if you will add that or no. So there you go, yeah, I add these beads. So again, it's up to you if you wanted to add the beads or not. But it doesn't uh, really affect the, the outcome of your project. So, I have fun making this and I'm very happy for the result of my crop top. So, what are you waiting for? Make your own crop top or a cover up. It's very easy and quick and you will love wearing it. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video.